Let's get ready. lighting is so bad but good morning guys today is Tuesday and I'm going out to breakfast with Paris she's already had her breakfast but we just wanted a change of scenery and we're also going with one of my girlfriends so I thought let's go together it's been a minute she's here super excited so let's get going my only issue is that like ubers are so far away we hardly have any around so they keep on cancelling but let's go i'm just wearing this old two piece of mine nothing fancy but i really like it i feel like when you don't know what to wear when you don't know what to wear wearing a cord set can make you feel so put together but yeah that is us. Please don't mind the mess. That and there's laundry on the floor. That needs to be done. It's been raining for so long. So yeah, just a lot going on. But anyway, let's get going. Thumbs up this video. Subscribe. Follow me on my socials. I'm at Theology everywhere.
zero and we're having breakfast. We just ordered mimosas and then we're gonna get some food going. Price is here. Hey. She's not having it. Juana, you must say hi. I should say hi. I wanna be in the vlog. Oh no cameras. The pork sausage. Pork sausage. Yes, please. And then can I get some scrambled eggs? And another straw because this one is being destroyed. Thank you. Yes, you can send me one. Because I want um, eggs. Hi, you. Medium. don't mind the bad lighting like it looks bad because it's from underneath but anyway today I'm at the mall I'm at Fushini with Paris I'm looking for an outfit for an all-white event that I'm going to on Saturday I just got some really oversized blazers so we're gonna try those on and see how do we look Paris is here <gasps> say hi baby anyway let's get the first one the first it's a blazer dress i got this in a size large i think the large is too large if you ask me i look so orange why do i look so orange but i'm gonna try it on in a size small because this no honey it is so big i just didn't want it to be like too short that's why i have to say i thought i would try with the large the small i think the small is too small because can you see I like the shape but I feel like when you close it this thing wrinkles can you see right here so when I close it it just looks weird you know it's not giving me what I wanted 
but I'm gonna try and the other blazers. These are just normal blazers, but really oversized. <sighs> so let's go. This is what I was envisioning. This is a normal blazer. It's just in a size 16. It's 600. I love this. Love the gold detail. I love how it sits here. I think I have a bigger size here. Oh no, this is smaller. But I love this. But I'm not sure if it's too short. Oh, but I love this. This is exactly the vibe. I'm trying to go through, you know. So, can you tell? Do you think it's too short? Like if I pick up my hands, my underwear is outside. But it's gorgeous. I love it. Hey guys, so I am about to get ready. I'm gonna do my makeup. This is my face. Yes, face. This is my face. I'm standing like this because if I'm here, I'm just in the sun. I'm exposed. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna do my face. We are going out for an early dinner, early-ish. Anyway, I'm going to meet up with my little niece and nephew i haven't seen them since we moved so that's about two months it's really really hot like it's really hot but i thought i would vlog this and i'm not gonna vlog the makeup you've seen that a hundred times but i thought i would take you with me in the night paris is here she got a pair of shades she's so cool now like she cannot stay away from them uh i just thought i'd get ready here because of the light okay yeah but the skin is looking so good that facial i really enjoyed it if you haven't seen that vlog check it out i got a glow facial at posh beauty and spa i'd love to get another one because i know with these things need to continuously go but my skin is honestly not complaining but i've also been doing so many masks now i do like a mask at least once a week because my skin showed me flames and i'll not take it for granted anymore but anyway let's get ready i have on my aligners it's invisible but it makes me talk funny it's like and I have to have them on for 22 hours a day. So it's pretty intense. Only when I'm eating, that's the only time I can take them out. But anyway, let's get ready. This is the before. So I'm done. It got dark a little bit later. I'm wearing this shirt that I got when I was pregnant from H&M. My makeup is really, really pink. really pink but I love it and then I have a skirt on this mirror is dirty right here because Paris kept on touching it and then I got a new set of rings from from Truett they look so nice let's see if I can focus them yeah these are the rings they're from Truett I love them I do Anyway, anyway, let us go.
a new day and we have a very exciting day today. I'm going out to have it. We are going to an all white event that is in Rosebank at La Parada. So we're having a fun parents day out. Paris is going to stay with my niece and nephew. She's going to have a sleepover with them. So super exciting times. We're literally going to have quality time. But right now it's time for me to get ready. Remember I was shopping the other day for the thing? This event, okay, today. So I'm going to start getting ready. Paris is taking her nap. The time is half past 12 now. I'm assuming that we should get there at like three-ish. So half past 12, but to actually be ready, basically. Uh, I'm not hungry, but I would love to eat before I leave so that I'm not hungry when I get there. Also, I like to eat so that I brush my teeth and then my teeth are just white for the day. Uh, but I'm not hungry, so I'm going to have a yogurt. Hopefully my appetite increases, then I have something else and then I can brush my teeth before my makeup is done and then, you know, that's my train of thought. Um, I'm also starting with my baby hairs. I start with my baby hairs before my makeup because I don't like foundation in my brush. I use my old toothbrush for my edges and got to be. So I always start with that and then I'll do my makeup. And then on my face, I'm going to be applying E45 for, it makes my skin feel so soft and glowy. Elizabeth Arden, 8 hours skin protectant on the lips. I also wanted to show you what I picked up. Um, the other day when I went to the shops, I went past Mr. Price because I was still just browsing and then I decided to try this. Oh my goodness. This is the Quick Face uh, Infinite Hydration Mist. This was only 89 grand. This is Ayana Tabita and Lungile Tabita's makeup line. I also picked up this liquid drip. I tried this. It's from Scarlet Hill. I tried this yesterday. It didn't really... It did not perform. <laughs> it did not perform. Like, you know when you put it here and then you're going to blend it up. It didn't blend. And when I put my foundation on top, it was just like... You could see it, it was so bad. But I'll try again today with a different strategy. I don't think you should let this sit. You should apply it and like uh, mix it into your skin immediately. Anyway, um, thumbs it up. Leave me a comment down below on how do you get ready. Do you start with your hair or your makeup? Outfit, what's the deal? For me, usually hair, then makeup, then outfit. Outfit is always lost. Especially because I have a child who's messy. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna start with the baby hairs. I'm actually unbraiding this next week. And then I'm going to do same braids, just black. <laughs> but I'm also thinking of cutting my hair for the summer, like for December. I'm just having like a cute ass haircut. It's either it's gonna be like a pixie cut or or like that short blonde hair. But I'm really gravitating towards the short blonde hair because I've been saying I wanna do it. I've been saying I wanna do it. So today, what am I saying today? I might finally actually do it. You know what I like when people do those baby hairs that like come forward and they have the things. But I just can't do that. Also, I think you need to have like the proper baby hair brush. This toothbrush is not the best thing to use for the for baby hair, especially because it's really uneven. The bristles are not in the same level, so that's the issue. So yesterday we went out for dinner. We had so much fun. That sushi, it was too so good. It tasted like sushi from Durban because there it's like so fresh and I've tried sushi before around like here in Hawking and I've never been like oh my god but that one I was so impressed with the presentation and how fresh it was plus it was it's half price from Monday to Friday sushi is half price so we got so much and was 
we got it at such a good price so definitely not complaining about that the name of the name of that restaurant is deep in the back deep in the back deep in the back oh look at this one african skills are poor but yeah let me just focus for a second okay so maybe he's done it's okay it's nothing more but it's okay so the makeup i would like to actually do today i'd like to do a smoky eye like a really heavy eye and a nudish lip and that's not really my go-to makeup look so i'm going to try i saw a picture but i mean i'm not i'm not like pro makeup artist <laughs> can manage my face you know um but okay so i'm gonna start with my eyes and then i'll show you afterwards how it looks hopefully it looks decent <laughs> because i don't have time so i'm just playing some music my favorite album right now, I know I'm so late to the party, but it's Summer Walker's album, still over it. Yo, the album is, I, like, I can hear everything she's saying. She went through so much pain, she, but I'm loving that album. I play it every single day. <laughs> but anyway, let me start this and hopefully it goes well. I'll come back when the eyes are done. So I'm almost done with my makeup look. I try to do like a dark navy a smoky eye. It was so bad. I just wiped it off and then I just did my regular brown cut crease thing. My makeup is looking a bit actually right now because I said it so many times because I wanted to last the whole night. But with time, it's definitely gonna get better. So. I've decided I'm gonna eat. Ew, that is. <laughs> I'm gonna have cereal, brush my teeth, I'm feeding Paris, and then I'll change and then we'll go drop her off. But I thought I would check in and then once my lip is done, I'll show you the whole thing. But let me know what she thinks. Oh my gosh. So I want to show you something interesting. Oh, on my lips, I have a brown pencil which I use for my eyebrows and a really pink pencil but when they are mixed together they make this like sultry look i got this shapewear thing from mm, babes he has a lot excuse me my nose is running but i got this shapewear from true it's ne? it's a whole body thing it's like this but i'm putting it down because my blazer comes down yeah. The interesting thing, because I'm just going to wear the place on top. The interesting thing is that this thing has a hole. Like right here. And when I put it on, I'm like, hey, what's I got done? Is it torn? I take it off and I see. It's not torn. The hole is meant to be there. So I'm under the assumption that it's for when you go to the bathroom, you just... I don't know. I don't know if... Shh, babes. I don't know if do you guys have experience in something like this because I usually just wear my tights but I was like let me try this because I don't know for security now my other issue is babes please don't mind the mess my other issue is that this thing is giving me severe steady light can you see because it's so tight and it scrunches like extra here and here you know it's it's, it's doubled here so i'm just like i don't know but i'm going to show you that i got this and then i'm wearing this bra uh at the back it has like a thing i don't know how to explain it but basically put it on in the front because i didn't want to wear an ordinary bra because the again my blazer comes down so the detailing here is shown anyway this is the face let's put on the blazer 
see which shoes we're gonna pair it with, blah blah blah, all of that. Pair us in front of Santa. Asha. And Santa. A box Okay. I'm not sure if can you see me? Can you see me? This is the blazer. Titanic. This is what I'm saying with the cellulites. I have cellulite but not this much. Um, but basically this is the blazer dress. The necklaces are from Truitts. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they're from Truitts. And then I'm wearing these heels uh, which I got from Zara. My Dad, don't touch me. Why are you touching me? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. So I'm wearing these oh goodness, I'm wearing these heels from Zara. I'm going to be carrying this cute little pouch which I got from it's from YSL. So I'm gonna be carrying this and then oh goodness, I'm so out of focus. Focus. Um, let me try a better angle. Hold. On. Okay. All right. So I hope I'm in focus now. But basically, this is my OOTD. I'm not sure. I'm still gonna try black heels, but I really like these because they're so comfortable. We have. We have. But basically, the blazer is from Fashini, like I mentioned. The shoes are Zara. And then I have this cute little pouch that I've never used. It's from YSL Beauty. It came with my perfume. So, yeah. so what do you think? And my necklaces are from Truex as well as my earrings. Yeah, it's so fun. Okay, so, but no, no. Why are you wearing my shoes? It's not. This is this dress? So this is the second option of shoes. They get that they can't see. These are the black strappy heels. These shoes are not very comfortable. I got these from Selfast. You definitely get what you're paying for. They were really cheap, but in J, I don't feel comfortable or stable. What do you think? Which one goes with the bag room, like with the vibe? I feel like this also cuts me off at my legs because of the straps so I'm really not sure I'd love to hear your opinion but basically a OTD of the day I hope you enjoyed us getting ready together I don't think I'll vlog at the event but I'll put snippets if I can of what happened